This is what I got the uh, Blue Air, the new version 311i and 211i. Oh, this is the Mo, but this i version is come uh, work with the smart one and looks so pretty, like a Google Mini speaker, the Gree version. But it's very light overall. It's very like a probably I would think maybe a pound, less than two pound. It's very definitely very light. So that's how it looks like very like a modernized design compared to the older version, the one without eye. The 211 plus, those are back color. It looks very pretty. I think this part, this little gray um, cloth, you can exchange it to other color. You can buy it from online. So I think that's a couple other light color, which is very pretty. I don't remember how to take this off. Oh, there you go. Yeah. So that's how it looks like. A little fan here. And this is the filter inside. Oh, this is like a socks. Yeah, this is the one you can wash it. Replace it with different color. And this is the filter with the little the carbon one inside. Yeah. That's why it's so light. And let's put it back on. Let me do this. So this is a socks. It's washable. The filter, I think you have to replace, like, I think when the apps tell you, like, time to replace, that's the time you have to replace. Definitely looks cool, like, and let's see how it does, because it looks like the Blue Air is a good brand for air purifier. Let's just turn it and lock, and then they have a speed control. A light mode, automatic, uh, Wi-Fi, one, two, three level, power on. It's very, everything so simple. Let's see the diameter, right? It's 11.5 inches. And then the height is about 19 inches, but it's very light. It's about like roughly poundish. It's definitely very light. So we can turn on, you can use the app. It's very simple button on here, but on the phone you can pay with more stuff. You just turn on auto mode. I just set, you can set the light color. Right now I set it to 9%. So if you have 100%, this light and this light would be very bright. So right now you see this is blinking. So that means they're trying to connect to the internet right now. You see the Wi-Fi signal right here. And we have auto mode. And then this device is covered like um, mid size of the room, like 357 up to 929 uh, square feet of the uh, of the room. So which is good. And this thing you can replace to a different color. This little big cloth is kind of like back of the big like item particles, and you can replace to different color and be washable too. So I like it. And they, right now I set it to um, auto mode. So it depends how the airs on this room they will change it might be one two or stronger so let's test out the voice right so this is night mode it's very quiet it cannot hear anything this is one now you hear some fan blowing out but it's definitely quiet too and you number two now it's stronger and the wind is blowing out too so i think at light Time when you're sleeping, having two might be too much. I was like, usually at night, I'm gonna turn it to night mode or auto mode. Assuming your room is being, being clean for a long time, if your room is clean, it's an excellent like um, air. When you set to auto, it's gonna be slow anyway. And number three is even more stronger. Look at me. You see the wind blowing? My hair, you can tell my hair, right? So it's very loud, definitely number three and number two. So number two, it has a little bit of air coming through my face, but not blowing my hair. So which is good. So it's one button you control anything. So for number one, and then there's a, on the app, they have a trial lock, avoid the kick pressing the button by accident and yeah and the filter itself I think if you want like 24 7 you pretty much need to replace every 
60 days, depend how much you use it. But your phone will tell you like, if it see a red signal, it's, very, it's definitely you need to replace at that time. So this is the version of 311 and let's open up for 211 and compare. Bigger versions for a bigger room. Um, I think this is the biggest size I can get under the blue series. Okay, this is how it looks like inside. Open it. This instruction manual, which I never read. Okay, we take this away. Again, you have the app control telling you the the um, the status of the air quality in the room, and then you can control with Google. Play an app. I mean, the Google Voice Alexa, which is good. You can set schedule too. That's why I try to get the uh, the iCV version. It's definitely look bigger compared to 311. And this is the same thing, the Max version. Oh, when I lift it, it's not that heavy too. Probably like maybe two pound-ish. You can simply move around the room without like worry, like being heavy. It's very to carry, easy to carry around. Let's compare. So earlier, this is 11.5, the diameter. This one is 13.5. And the height, let's see. This is up to 22 inches tall. Taller, slightly taller and wider. Surprisingly, the 211 i is a square shape versus 311 is a circle. And let's open up and take a look inside. Oh, and the plug is slightly different too. If I turn off, right, will work adapter to see how different this is just a normal standard adapter and this is how it looks inside of oh the fan is definitely bigger Let's turn okay yes yeah, definitely slightly bigger for sure actually the blade is also different too if you look closely i'm not sure if you're able to see it this is more like a flam fan bait like one two three four five that's five like blades on it and this one is like like a succulent blade it's like so many of them I think it's more than 10. You see the round side? So it's, the blade is definitely different. This thing is, if I look at it, it sounds metal. This one is plastic. So yeah, definitely feel like this is worth the money, huh? This is slightly more high quality design, huh? I guess probably just the womb doesn't really matter. <laughs> I don't care. All right, so let's push it back in. And you can buy a different color. Cloth too have the they, have, they also have different color other than gray. You have green, red. I think a little bit dark gray. I don't remember anymore. But this is the filter. How it looks like taking out. So this is a square shape of filter. So the filter definitely bigger than the one the other one which we saw earlier. And it's the same. Uh, usage, I think it's like if you turn on 24-7, you pretty much need to replace this filter. Um, take this out. Just take this out and replace it. Um, I mean, yeah, it, it, this one also has come with the carbon filter, which is, I mean, blocking off the smoke. And this is like, this is a normal blocking off the dust, this fine dust particle, and then the pollen, mites, moon. Yeah, filter is square, the other one filter is round, and let's put it back. Did it well. This should be this way. <laughs> Look at, they'll tell you too. So inside is pretty empty, same as the other one. Here is empty. So you just put the cloth back. I like it, it's very like simple, and it looks like so modernary, this device. Like a contemporary design. Doesn't look like a purifier, you know? It looks like a chair to me. <laughs> this thing, this self itself, is feel heavier than the one here. Just FYI. That's why I probably add another pound on it. Okay, and then this is lock. So it's very easy taking out, locking it. Like no issues, very simple. And just peel it off. Oh, look at this. Oh my goodness. Look at this. I think this one, how much is it? I think it's over 300, but if you check online, it's, the price is there. Wow, this is amazing. So let's connect to it. And we're gonna connect to the app. 
Oh, look at this. Wow. Let's turn it on. I'll connect the app later. Oh, there's four level of fan. This one has three level. If you look, take a look. One, two, three. And this is a four blade. So if I keep, this is the sound. So let me see. So this is how it sounds as a level one. I think we have some air particle here. So PM 2.5 is just how fine the particle percent exiting air should be down to zero based on what I learned from here. So that means our household has a super very fine particle that needs to be filtered right now. And right now it's just pie chart to try to connect it on the internet, but we'll do it later. So let's try blade number two. Let me see if it's plus here. Oh, it's plus here. Wow. Okay, stronger my air okay I don't feel much I feel air it's, it's not blowing my hair that much Wow feel a little bit shaking this things I feel shaking compared here this one I don't feel much shake I feel a little bit shaking here let's try number three the sound So you see the wind blowing my face. Again, um, actually, when I do two, I feel like two is shaking more, but number three, I don't feel much shake on it. Huh, that's very interesting. So let's try number four, the sound. Oh, you see the fan blowing me? It's very strong. Oh, number two, now see, it's decreasing now. is showing you the PM level the fine particle versus here this would not tell you this device is only tell you when you go into the app itself so that's one thing good about this one additional information that we won't able to show here unless you have the app which is good in the night mode hmm, I guess the night mode they don't do PM anymore huh it's very interesting I feel like the auto and the night mode is doable when you sleep again the auto mode is good to turn when you sleep when your room is very has a very excellent air quality. Otherwise, it's gonna be very strong, I would assume. Oh, what is this? PM2, PM1. Wow, this is more a best unit. You might want to invest this one instead, even though like up like it cover 600 up to 1500 square feet. I feel like you have more feature here than this one. I can, I can smell the blue air, filter air smells too, which is very good. So again, this button, PM, the size of the particle. So the highest, the biggest, the, the smallest, the, small, uh, the smaller it is. And this, this one compared this one is a hundred dollar difference. I think this is why this one has more fancier. You have a little bit display screen. So if I press this two button at the same time, you can change the color as well as here. This two button, it will change the color, like the brightness. It's five seconds. And then now if I keep pressing, see, you see the color? It's bright and then brighter, less, less, less. There you go. And then the trial lock, it basically press this button, hold it for five seconds. There you go, there's a child lock, so they cannot press anything right here. You see, when I press anything, it's not gonna work. It's all lock. So five, five seconds, maybe release, let's try it. There you go, now you can press now. Yeah, I definitely don't like number two settings. The number two, this thing, device is like shaking so badly. I can't even see it myself too. And you can feel it too. Somehow when you get to one, three, four, it's fine. Yeah, I think it has to do with the motor, so when you get to Three, it use more power to spin and then that vibration is gone so I don't definitely don't like the disadvantages that don't that if you don't care it's fine but like me I kind of care like shaking like I definitely don't like number two fan mode 
Yeah, so um, when the filter is time to replace, this one has to tell you the app, and this one, when the filter is ready to replace, it will show on here in red color. So that is the time you need to uh, replace the filter. So that, I think this is why you have to pay 100 more from, from um, uh, 311 to 211. I think simply the fan is bigger, cover bigger size. It's also because of this little panel here. So that is the difference. And now let's try the, uh, the Dyson. So this is a Dyson. Um, I also want to try out, but I feel like I have a feeling um, the airs, the blue airs would be the best for air filter because this is only focused one thing versus here is focused, has two in one where it has the fan, playlist fan, and as well as the filter, which is heat H13. And yep, I got this one because it's like, um, I think that's a discount on it, $100 off right now on sale. That's why I got it. And this is the standard plug. It feels very light. And then it has the filter. And it has the instruction manuals. So half a size filter you combine into a single one. Looks like it. Let's see. Okay. Hey, the filter is where we um compared the the blue one is more uh the blue one is more open and this is more like close together so i'm not sure if there's any difference on it but i'm pretty sure it's gonna be the same thing doing the same job but definitely like uh when replacing the filter dyson's filter is definitely more expensive than the blue air which i already saw the price and then how can I install the filter? Battery is gonna be somewhere. Okay, it will tell you instructions. Let's take a look. Oh, there's a sticker. Oh, there you go. Okay, let's peel this off. So this is the gold white version. That's one with the silver version. So assuming that's how, yep, yeah, that's how you pop open. So I need to put it back down. Let's pop it back down. So that is your filter, where you install the filter, um, and then take this out. Oh, there we go. Oh, they, they tell you what kind of what kind of stuff they are doing. Oh, there's three layers. So there's one layer, there's two layer, which is backing off VOC and whatever the chemical, all this PM 2.5, PM 10. And as well as, as a filter itself. So it's three layers. Okay, now next, which one is, is there upside down? All right, so it's figured out. Um, this thick layer is supposed to be facing down, which pretty much um, you can tell as well. So we're gonna put it. I think this is why it's also expensive than the air because it's three layer. This is one layer. This is the carbon filter, and this is the normal like a filter. That's why it's more expensive. And also it's Dyson. Dyson is like, Regardless, it, it, you have to pay for premium price for it. Okay, so you can do one at a time as well too. There's a snap here. There's a little step here. And then it's a curve. And then now we can put the second layer in. And then click and snap. It's very easy to do. It's just like click and snap. It's all lock. If it's just unlock it, there's a button here. Press it down, it'll come out. And same as here, press it down, it'll come out. So let's put this back in. Step and lock. And now we're gonna do this one. Step and lock. I think this is the right. Yeah. Doesn't matter. Just do here, doesn't matter. There you go. Step and lock. Again, this one, 
um, we got the TP-CO9 and this TP-CO9 you can connect to the app for motor high as well so that's why I got this one which is the latest brand and this device is like um, two uh, I think it's two years already that came out so I'm expecting they might have a new one maybe TN10 in the future very very fast <laughs> So where's my remote? Yes, here's my remote. Which is like so cool, look at this. It's a rose gold color. So let's plug it in and let's try it out. So let's plug it in, it's a normal... Oh, there's a fuse here too. So I guess in case the fuse is burned out, you can replace it easily, I would assume. I would assume, I don't know. <laughs> so let's start it. Oh, that's cool too. That's another little premium price you also get a colorful L, L, I'm not sure if LCD or LED display or OLED display whichever that is right now I have the font and the fan on I think it's telling you uh, I think you can spin the fan too oh you can pay with the angle too rotation 45 95 and how can I make it higher four five six okay let's start with number one so this is the sound number one very quiet. Number two. Not bad, still quiet. Number three. I like where it has a little bit display telling you what to do, but I feel like if you lose this remote control, you cannot control anywhere on this de device here. You have to control through the apps. Let's try number four. Speak, span. Okay, I think it start getting louder. Number four is still doable. If we talk about sleeping at night, have this thing on with the fan. Oh, number five is very loud now. Number six. Dyson is so cool. Stick your hand. Oh, it's not gonna chop my hand. Feels strong, the wind blowing out. Number seven. Ooh. It's getting now. I think I think when you sleep, getting level six and higher is gonna be very loud. It will disturb your sleeping too. So stay with like five or below will be okay. Assuming you're not opening the AC, of course. And number eight. Wow. Oh, so strong. I feel my hair is blowing. Number nine. Wow. So strong. Oh, feels cool. Number ten. Wow. Where that's I think that's ten is the highest I can get. Yep, 10 is the highest. It's the highest you can get. So every time you cut something, this thing will be paused. It's not gonna spin. That's our notice too. Yeah, let's do auto. And what does I stand for? Oh, telling you the particle, PM. The size of the particle display. That's right. Like how many degree I can play with? There's 45, my options. Uh, it will say stop, not to have any turn. 45, 90, 180, 355. It's awesome, I like it. Like 355, I know you can do like 355. So that's one good about Dyson with the fan, huh? But make sure when you have the air purify on, uh, make sure your air, uh, your door is closed, windows stay closed, or else it's like defeat the purpose. You, you, you're filtering your home room, but at the same time, you have like bad air coming in, so you're gonna make it even worse. Your filter gonna worn out even faster. Uh, yes, and then this one, this button here, is the airflow directions. Right now, it's coming this way. So if I press it, it'll go switch to the back. So the airflow will come from the back now. This is no air. But I feel like, yeah, because it coming from this little gap here, I feel like it's blocking off some air, not as strong, compared to the one that come out directly from here. Oh, there's some shit flying around. Fuck. 
flies back. Okay, so if you press again, it will switch to fun airflow instead of the back now. So yeah, as soon as this is on, the air purifier on at the same time, so you don't have to do it separately. Um, and then this one is a sleep mode, and let's, let's try, see what happened, how quiet would that be? Oh, the sleep mode you can pay with the hour. Oh, now everything drop become fan number four. So I think, yeah, which I was right. If you can, if you sleep like five below, it would be very quiet. About five is very loud. So I don't think you can sleep with like having a fan on with six or about. And no sleep mode. Oh, so the sleep mode is basically a timer to me. One hour, two hour, four hour, eight hour, and then stay on. What I think is like the blue air is better because when you do the stick mode, the blue air does everything for you. You don't have to press like one hour, two hour, three hours. Blue air, don't, once you press the light mode and they'll do it automatic for us. And the app, we'll, which we'll go over later, um, this one air have a schedule, but we'll figure out like this one if they have a schedule in a bit on that. In terms of the price, right? One of this Dyson is equal to of this blue air. Um, it depends what you want to be. So I want to have one device, which is this, has um, fan and the air purifier, but I know ahead of time because this two doing two different things at the same time. The air filter compared to blue might not be as strong, um, as strong or might not be good uh, compared to this two. And then because I want to have the fan, so that's why I, hey, let me still try it. it. It might not, maybe they have some improvement. Um, but I feel like for cleaning, having a clean air, the timer, the blue is faster, which I can tell. Um, yeah, by looking at the size. The reason I can tell is like, this is the filter right here, right? The blue, the filter is from all this gray area and the bigger is the gray area and then the fan is always so big, so I can tell the time that needs to clean the air for the room, the blue air will be the winner. And this, it, it, the Dyson will does the job, but just like pile a like, longer time. So that's why like depends what you need. Um, if you just focus on air purifier, blue would be the blue air would be the good choice. If you want like all you want is of having so many like uh, equipment at home, like a fan unit a um, heating unit or a purifier unit and maybe Dyson all in one would be the good choice for you. Um, this one I didn't get the heat version because I feel like I don't need it. That's why I just got the fan and the air purifier version, the latest TP09. Okay and one thing I found out this remote because it's so small it might be easy to lose. They have a very good design. So uh, here you can stick here. You can stick on here too. I think this is strong. Is there some, some magnet in in here, up to here, I think. Let's see. No, this is not here, not here, not here. Yeah, they have a magnet. I think it's from, from here to here. So you won't lose your, your remote control. I think this way is stronger. This way is better. This is the air. So the app has a profile, Mac quality, it's near our area, and it's, it'll show like, we have installed 211i and 311i. Now currently the home saying excellent air, like the auto mode, fan speed, try a lot at night, and then you can set it how bright you want it to be. So we just set it like very low at the moment, and it will tell you the filter light as, as well. And then it's time to repage. You can add schedule, like what time to what time, what more you want to be, pattern, if it's every day or certain days. And you can name a, uh, a new label for your schedule. You can have more than one schedule for day. So I feel like um, for the two eleven I is whatever you see here. Whatever you see here, you place itself because you have the computer uh, screen. However, on the three um, eleven I, uh, we can only see all the detail is through here, like um, the fan speed like all the PMI 2.5 and yeah for 311 it only do like P, uh, PM 2.5 you're not gonna see PM 1 or PM 10 uh, so that is the difference between 211i and versus 311i 
and it's the same like setup like you can select all the fan speed here auto trial light and light and then while you select the span, fan speed you can set like the uh the control one two three by slowly so we just set it to auto right now let it control the speed based on the map here right now the the room quality is excellent and then you can select the light mode trial lock. So yeah, this like the level of speed you not can it won't display on the uh, 311i. Um, you you can only see through the app. And then again, the filter, as schedule, home, and that's it. This is the um, Dyson's app, and I think it's the interface better than the uh, Blue Air, and it's tell you like where I am. House outside the humidity and the temperature, and this is at home temperature. Like this is at home temperature. This is the uh, the humidity at home. Five signal connections. The H C H O is okay, but still found like is in the high range. So they hopefully it'll get lower down after we have this turn on. I feel like this is has more explanations if you click on it. O two one is good. And then fair pool. I feel like this app is more um, user, friend, more detail given to you what is good and what is bad. Like yeah, right now I'm good. I'm in the mid range already. Yeah, I, I feel like I like this app more. It's telling you explanation what is the good range. So which will let you learn more. And also explain to you what is this like HCHO. PM10, all the explanation is very self explanatory, which I like, like, versus like the blue air. The app doesn't tell you the definitions, like, not everyone would know it right away what is PM, right? So I like this app better. And then this is all the graph. What else? Uh, you can add machine, add account, digital assistance. And you can set the notification from the email. You can add schedule to the machine. So you can you can do voice control, which I check with uh, using Google. It works well. Uh, you can buy part accessory or nice thing was the uh, Blue Air. And if you go back to the main menu right here, the house, you can control all the re remote right here. Do down here, up down. So yeah, those are the two apps that I've been wanting and see. And I like the, the app version because I don't have to like, um, for example, like Dyson, you can do voice control, but then like uh, Blue Air, they don't have remote control. So with the app given, it's easy to like control using a, using a phone as a remote versus I have to walk there and then adjust the settings, right? So somehow I feel like having the app um, link to the pay a little bit extra to have the apps from your phone is is a plus what I'm thinking. And that's it for this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you the next video.